Well, this week we're giving away tickets to see Barry Manilow next week. We've got a brand new giveaway, mm -hmm. a chance to see the group Celtic Thunder. A few days ago, I talked with one member of the group about what to expect from the show. The international smash hit singing sensation Celtic Thunder is coming to Omaha. The date, February 21st at the Orpheum, showing our city the talent that's delighted audiences all over. Group member Emmett O'Hanlon joins us via Skype today. Good morning, Emmett. It's nice to see you. Hi, how's it going? Hi. So what can we expect from the show? Uh, well, I don't want to give away too much, but... Uh... Some of the surprises that have been revealed are is, is that uh, we're bringing back Damien, who is uh, one of the originals, one of the original Celtic Thunder lads, mm -hmm. and uh, he's our guest performer. So it's actually going to be six guys rather than five, like the last tour. And uh, it's basically all the best songs that we've ever done, oh. uh, all in one show. So. Nice. How did you start singing and then become part of the group? What's your story? Uh, well. <laughs> um, it, it's kind of so I, I started singing when I was you know eight um, and uh, I've uh, been taking voice lessons ever since and actually I accidentally met Sharon uh, the producer of the group Sharon Brown about two years ago and uh, and she had seen a video that was put up on YouTube uh, of me from uh, a master class that I did at school which was, uh, I was getting my master's at Juilliard at the time and uh, I had accidentally met her, and she was actually reaching out to uh, to speak with me about about singing for her. So mm. it kind of all accidentally fell into place, <laughs> and that's uh, great. And I sang for her a few times, and and uh, you know the rest is history. That's kismet, right? <laughs> it sort of feels yeah, yeah. meant to be. Yeah, right. What it, for uh, yeah. for you as a performer? What is your favorite song to sing? Uh, my favorite song. Yeah, what do you enjoy? Like what? Even yeah. you, you could sing it a million times, and it could still get you. Uh, well, I mean, it's a little geeky, but I was I was actually I was trained as an opera singer. Oh. So, uh, so yeah, the, the, actually the role the role of Valentin uh, in uh, in uh, Faust mm -hmm. is probably one of those roles. Just sing it a million times and never get tired of it. Yeah. What do you like best about about touring? Now I know it's not all. Right, it's not all fabulous. There's a lot of work that goes into being on the road. But what do you enjoy uh, yeah, most about it, it? it? It's not, I wouldn't say fabulous. It's, yeah. uh, it's, uh, <laughs> it's kind of like uh, being at camp, I'd say. It's, uh, you know, we're all in bunks on the, on the bus, and it's just like, you're, you know, you goof around the whole time. Uh -huh. and, uh, and actually, if you, if you look closely on stage, that's kind of what we're doing the whole time, is just moving around and trying to make each other laugh. Yeah. But it makes the show great. It, yeah. you know, it makes the show a lot of fun to watch. For fans um, to see it, you recently yeah, wrapped yeah. up a, a Celtic Thunder cruise. That had to have been fun, since you all get along so well. But what is it like then to interact with fans on a cruise ship? <laughs> How did you enjoy that? Yeah, it's uh, it, it, it's interesting. I had actually never been on a cruise at all, uh -huh. and uh, and then I was you know thrown onto a ship of five thousand you know, Thunderheads, <laughs> as we call them. Right. Uh, and it was actually, it, was, it wasn't like anything I was expecting. You know, I was expecting to be very kind of claustrophobic and, and, uh, and a lot of very, you know, like, in, and it was my first interaction with the fans, so I thought it was going to be a little overwhelming. And it was overwhelming, but uh, in, in, in a good way, you know. It was, all the fans were so supportive, and they were really, really nice about the fact that I was the new guy. And, uh, and you know, it, it's a rough, it's a, it is a rough four or five days where, I mean, we're performing every day multiple times a day we're doing uh, a lot of promo events on on the uh, ship we're doing special events like um there's bingo and there's there's uh, uh pub great, quizzes though. and stuff and, yeah. and but uh, we 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 make sure to have a bit of fun how can when you're playing bingo gotta have fun uh and of course, then of, of course coming to omaha and that's the whole reason we wanted to steal a few minutes with you today again the show coming up on february 21st at the orpheum mm -hmm. ticketomaha.com if you'd like to grab your tickets get more information about the show. In the meantime, Emmett, take good care, safe travels, and we'll see you Thank here you in Omaha much. real soon. Yeah, see you soon. Thank you. Mike?